Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. So we have seen the how we can see the nodes, the nodes. What are the nodes created by the DOM? So we have seen those all the things in the browser also in the Dev Tools. We have seen it so using the child nodes property. Now let's try to write the body and create some nodes, uh, create some elements, and we'll see that whether these elements are also created as nodes or not. Just I want to show you. So here I am having a body. In this body, I am having one div tag. So this is the element node. Okay, this is an element node. And without any uh, HTML element or anything. So this is the lone text node. Alone text node without element. Alone text node. And we have another one that is nothing but comment. So we know about this comment also this is the comment node okay i am i am making it as comment node whatever it may be so i am making this one as comment and then we can have paragraph so this is the paragraph element node so here <coughs> we have created a body tag and in this one we are having a div development so this is normal text node and this is a comment node this one is a paragraph node and in return in this paragraph node we have a, again a text node so let's try to see how these are created now if you go into this one in the nodes.html let's open this one yeah here we are able to see the output right this is an element node alone text node like this we are able to see i don't know why this uh, gap has come okay this is a paragraph right so default by default it has margin okay fine so let's try to check document dot body so you can check directly document dot body oh so everything whatever you want to do so you can check it with the document dot body so i press document dot body so this is the document dot body okay and by this we are able to understand that so this is a element this is a text node and this is a comment node and this is a paragraph node this one is injected by the live server and this is also a script code so here this is this is how we are able to see that these are all the nodes are created so if you want to see more means so we can, I can write document dot get elements sorry get elements by tag name of body i can write it by like this now if you try to see that this is an html collection in this body we are having one element node in this body in this body you will have a property that is nothing but child nodes so that we can see all the nodes that are created in this body where is the chill nodes yeah here we are able to see the chill nodes in this chill nodes so we are able to see one text node which is an empty data is empty and the another one div okay and this is a text so like this yeah this is like this these all are created so by this we are able to understand that these all nodes chill nodes uh, nodes have been created successfully with the body fine so these all we have seen seen it now we need to know that what are the different types of nodes existing so the, we have seen that nodes and all those things fine so what are the nodes so for calculating these node types and all those things we have actually the three values one is node type okay you are having this one right let's try to take this one mm, let body body of zero you can have first one is the node type so that it will give you the node type what is the node type one is an element node we'll see what are the different types of nodes available and another one is the node name so we want to get details body and the last one is the node value so we also have a node value node value is null for this one again it has a nodes so these are the three main properties in order to retrieve the details about the node node type node name and also the node value so let's see what are the different types of node and it's a uh, constant values let's try to see one by one if you go open this w3 html so here you'll be able to see the different types of node types documents elements attributes and other nodes of html or xml documents has different node types there are 12 different node types which may have, which may have children of various node types okay so there are 12 so out of this only three or four four are very much important first one is an element node so which is a type one we are able to see so those are nothing but it's uh, these all new paragraph heading and all those things and next one is an attribute so attr so this one is a second one text text node and this is c data section c data section means so these are these are nothing but which are not parsed by the 
uh, parser and all those things comes under C data section. This is not that much of important for us. Entity reference, entity, these are all not important for us. Comment node. So we know about this comment node. Document. So this is the root document. So the entire document, it represents the entire document. So you need to understand that the document itself is a node. Okay. The document which you are trying to see, the object, document, object, that itself is a node. You need to understand it. So that is nothing but a document. Document type. So you will be able to see at the top, doc type HTML. We will try to give that standard DDD definition, right? That one also is converted into a document. Uh, sorry, node. Why? Because whatever the content is there in the HTML, it should be a part of the DOM. So that is the reason this all will be converted into a nodes. And another one is a document fragment. And last one is the notation. So out of these all the things, so these are the different types of note. Now, these are the different node types available in HTML. Out of these all the things, the very much important things are, first one is the element node. So this is the element node, text node, comment node, document, and also document type. Uh, not document type, document. So these are the four things which you will be using more often in the HTML. So remaining all are not that much of important, but these are all the different node types available in the HTML. So this is all. So here you'll be able to see the node type one and all those things. And here node types also, you'll be able to see the constant, named constants also you'll be able to see. So that's it. So these are all the different types. So which I want to discuss with you. Hope you understood about this one all. If you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. If you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.